Hey, how's it going everyone? Counter Stay here and welcome back to another unboxing and today I bring you... That went better in my mind. <laughs> I was hoping it would slide. Uh, yeah, uh, today I'm opening up a load of the McDonald's promo packs that they released. Oh, I want to say... October? I actually cannot remember for the life of me when uh, the McDonald's did the event for this. But I managed to get, I think, 10, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Uh, it was definitely before the Celebrations event because I wanted to build up a bundle and then the Celebrations was, you know, hitting the force. You know, just all these products coming out and I focused my attention on that the most. And today, I'm finally <laughs> opening these ones. I've got a nice little stack. Uh, I'm hoping to at least pull a hollow... Bulbasaur or Cyndaquil. That's all I'm hoping to pull in. I tell you, this is actually a very uh, nice way to jump back into unboxings because I've taken a very long break from unboxings. It's got to look, I mean, by the time this video's gone, it's probably a few days later from my previous unboxing. But whenever I did, uh, when I upload the the, pre, uh, the one before this, and it's most likely going to be the celebration of the lunch tin, that's probably been about two months. And now I'm calling this one because the celebrations was. <laughs> Oh man, what a ride that was. So, I thought I'd just take a break, and sorry to keep... I'll put a timestamp in when I actually start opening. Uh, I kind of um, bit off more than I could chew. I had the crazy idea of bulk recording things, like my Kane's vlogs, my unboxings, and it got to the stage where I'd be like, oh, I fancy editing this unboxing. So I edit the video, and then all of a sudden, Oh yeah, that was a great card I pulled in the last box I did. Oh. <laughs> I gotta edit that one first, so in the end it just it just made it very messy. So now I'm going back to my old way where I get the product, open the product, edit the video, upload the video, then move on to the next one. So I don't end up screwing myself up like that because it was happening. I'd be uploading a video and it's like, wait, I haven't uploaded the video with that card I'm talking about, you know, as an example, you know, and there was things like that. And yeah, here we go. Uh, how are we going to do this? I don't think it's going to get anything. I want to get a thumbnail. I'm going to try. That'll do. Uh, I was going to lay them out. I might just go like this. <laughs> so cool. Uh, actually, let's have a look. So this one I, looks like a picture frame for a card. Oh, for the cards, yeah. See, so I didn't go crazy. Sorry, I keep, <laughs> you know, changing topic. I didn't go crazy trying to get every single one of the, you know, these things. I'm just, I just want the cards. I'm not fussed about the little activities. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get all the packs out. So we've got a, it's actually a nifty little... That's a not a bad looking little photo frame for a card. I mean, I'm a collector, so I wouldn't leave my awesome cards you know, out in the open without a sleeve. Now we got a little colouring in, little booklet thing. Man, I remember when I was a kid, and you get things like this on the Macca's, you know, little lunchbox uh, Happy Meal thing. And do some colouring while we're eating. Alrighty, next one. So. Yeah, it got crazy around the world with everyone trying to buy so many of these. And honestly, it wasn't so bad here. Oh, I've got another one. I mean, there was never a situation where me and Luke went into a Macca's and it was like, oh, we don't have any more. Every time we went, there was <laughs> there was plenty there. It wasn't like there was any um, shortage. Is this a different one? Ooh, we've got stickers. Oh, now we're talking. I want stickers. And, oh, I've got a little activity there. Match each Pikachu with each one. Cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, pretty, oh, so there's one with different poses. Okay, I just, the only reason I spotted that because Cyndaquil, Wheel, uh, no flame. Flame. No shame. Ah, oh, scenery. So you put all the stickers on there. Gotcha. No shame, another sticker. I actually don't know how many there are. I want to say five, the magic number. Like of the different ones. I think this is a different one. Yes. Trading card case. 
Oh, it feels good to unbox again. <laughs> it really does. Mind you, I've taken a big break. I mean, the only thing I've been playing is uh, me and Luke started a, uh, another playthrough, and we only do that once a fortnight on our Friday night because it's almost like a you know, celebration. The weeks, you know, the work fortnight's over. We've got three days off. Oh, this is neat. Where was I going with that? Oh, recording. So, yeah, it's not just unboxings and vlogs that I've taken a break from uh, gameplay stuff as well. I finished all the games that I was currently playing through in, and I thought, all right, I've got a problem. I've got so many videos to edit and so many game playthroughs to edit. So I've just spent the last month or so editing a load of playthroughs, and i finished a load of playthroughs. Once again, I'm going to timestamp if you don't want to hear this stuff. The thing with my unboxings is... I'm a very shoot the shit kind of person. I know if I'm unboxing, I should be talking about the product, but I just like talking, you know, having a good old chat. That's actually really cool. I like that. I might put all the um, the remaining uh, cards that I don't get in this one. What have I done wrong? Ah. Hey, that's a, that is really cool. I like that. I hope we get a couple so I can put multiple there. Uh, you know, do multiple ones. Another colouring in, Pikachu with all the variety of Pokeballs. What? Well, how are we supposed... To... We've got to get coloured pencils, come on. <laughs> I can't even remember if you, if, you know, in my childhood, if we ever got pencils or crayons when we got Happy Meals and had to draw. I think that was only for birthday parties, I want to say. Oh, nice, got another one. Uh, oh, we've got another one. we got bigger stickers. Actually, that's some quite nice quality stickers. You always look, it, Pokemon Sapphire is so strange for me. I, Silver is my go-to... Oh, there's a maze there. Silver is my go-to game. That was my first Pokemon I ever owned and played and loved it to death. Pokemon Sapphire, I I played it three times. Played through it once with Mudkip. Uh, decided to start again. I picked Trico and... I absolutely loved my Skeptile, it was like level 80, but then I thought, I'm bored, I want to start again. And I regret it ever since, because I love my Skeptile. It's like my favourite, um, it's my favourite Pokemon for that gen. Oh, you do get different ones. Oh, so there is a sort of um, collectible aspect with those ones. Another card case. Alrighty, good stack. First one. So I was worried. Because I know, you know, you try and save the planet and Maccas, you know, <laughs> trying not to waste, you know, plastic in the ocean. Uh, straw. Actually, no, it's paper straw. Sorry, I'll take that back. Uh, but, oh, i got a charm in it. Sorry, I was trying to get that out before I opened it. Um, I'm hoping that there was no grease because of the paper. <laughs> nice. We st oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. There you go. Kind of annoyed that the hollow's at the front. <laughs> Alrighty, so we start off with a hollow Charmander. Nice, nice. A Schnivy. Send a quill! Man, I wish I'd got that as a hollow. And Mudkip. <laughs> That's cute. Hello, my name's Mudkip. Alrighty, so we're starting off strong. Oh, I wish it wasn't that way. Try and do it this way. Fucking genius. I haven't lost my edge. Furky. A squirrel. Turtwig. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you gonna give me every single fire hollow? I actually don't have. Oh, hang on. Oh, hang on. I was just saying, I don't really have a favourite starter from other... So after Gen 3, that was sort of it. For me, I don't really have a favourite. This is not going how I planned. It's like the cards have been there for a while. <laughs> Charmander, Fennekin, Turwig. 
<laughs> I'm not liking this. <laughs> What's another one? Uh, tall chick. I swear to God. Serious now. Oh, oh, it's not that one. It's okay. We got a monk. Actually, I changed my mind. I actually really like Grookey. I picked that for my Pokemon uh, uh, sword game. I actually really love Grookey. Oh, Tipik. <gasps> okay. Okay. It's not a Bulbasaur. It's not a Cyndaquil. But if this is a Squirtle, Luke is or a Totodile, Luke is going to kill me. Piplio. Never mind, not gonna kill me today, as if he was gonna. <clears throat> I ain't scared of him. Don't tell him I shake that. I was actually saying to Luke, you know, is there different drops for each chain? Because it felt like no matter what, because loot never pulled out a Bulbasaur or a Squirtle. It always seems to be like these ones, so I'm wondering if it's sort of... Oh, oh there you are. Why couldn't you have been hollow? That is such an adorable smile coming from Bulbasaur. Look at that. So happy. Come on. It's that face. Oh. Wordle. Give me Charmander. Oh, that would have been great. <gasps> yes! Oh, hello. Oh, I've got my sleeves. Oh, I really thought I was not going to get that because I already got one. Oh, that's awesome. I'm happy. I got one that I wanted. Beautiful. You're free now. Took me a while to get there, but we got there. I'm spewing because I wasn't really into the Pokemon thing at the time until I got a bit bored of Yu-Gi-Oh! and I really liked started. Uh, start to unbox Pokemon. I wish I'd done the McDonald's Prime when Onyx had one because that's it looks really cool Actually got a good uh, good uh, setup there. Sorry. I couldn't spit that out Charmander Hinder Quill Turtwig Froakie Oh, I'm not doing too bad. I haven't got a double yet, so I'm pretty happy with that. I wonder if the prices have gone down yet, because I know, from what I can remember, it's a little bit of a Mandela wreck. I'm sure I looked up that the Hollows people were sort of high pricing them, so hopefully they've gone down a little bit. Mind you, Charmander is always the sort of... A top card that everyone wants to get and sell, so I don't have to worry about that one. Snivy. Fennekin. Rally, come on. Oh, I jinxed it. How many I got left? Got three. I haven't seen it, because I'm just, because Luke, he, cause he, at the same time he was getting them, he didn't pull out a single total of Squirtle, so I haven't seen a hollow of them yet. I've seen everything else to this point now. Ah, oh, spoiled it. It's a fire though. Charmander. Oh, come on. Cyndaquil. Rail it. Score bunny! Monk will kick your fucking ass, mate. Got a drum. I think I've got every fire except Cyndaquil. God damn. Jesus. <laughs> Trico! That's actually a really cool looking Trico. Wait, have we not... Oh, it's the sticker I was talking about. I don't think we pulled out a Trico yet. Chespin. Toto Doyle. Oh, Sean. Oh, man. I'm feeling lucky. 
I'm feeling lucky. Mm. It's a fire. So, <laughs> it could be. I don't know what I was thinking. I lost my thought. Come on. Come on. Tell you what. Let's do a Steelix. Freaky. Fannikin. Oshwa. Actually, no, I was... They're the start of three. Well, no, obviously not. Okay, come on. Cyndaquil. Cyndaquil. That was my first Pokemon I ever picked in Pokemon Silver. Come on. Oh, you... <laughs> God damn it. It's three Littons now? No, I can build a deck around that. Okay, I, I tell you what, I'll get the stars of the show. I didn't get a single Gen 2. Nah, holy crap. And I still haven't seen a Squirtle, but I tell you what, good little haul this, and um, before I do anything, I might quickly just sleeve them all. Actually, no, I'll do it. <laughs> I won't waste footage. I'll just get the Charmander one. So it's been a couple of months, but I think done pretty good. From just, you know, a small stack of 10, managed to get Charmander and Bulbasaur. I'm hoping they're a little bit low in price now, because I'll just, like my um, celebrations, even though I'm really pissed, I wish I had waited, I ended up buying a Venusaur, because it was the one I wanted. Literally pulled out a Venusaur in the lunch tin. So, what I'll do, I'll just buy the Cyndaquil and just complete my, like, what I need. And uh, hopefully I can complete the whole set, because I've pulled out a majority of them all. I, did pretty well, if I don't say so myself. What do I need? Just try and f I need all of Gen 3. Now I mention it. <laughs> so I didn't do too well. But I need Squirtle. No Gen 2. Shit. <laughs> Actually, uh, I've got a bit to go. It's your fault. Alright, everyone. I won't hold this up any longer. Thank you all for watching. And I will see you later. I'm back. Let's see if this actually you know, works out. Come on, come on. I mean, that's a nifty little you know, little deck box. I mean, you wouldn't mind if you were, you know, 9 or 10 because you didn't give a shit about the condition of your cards, but I personally wouldn't do it today. But that's pretty cool. Keep them all in there, and then when, you know, going through my collection, I at least know what's in there. Really awesome.